So, so let's talk about a few things. You personally are a, a culinary anthropologist. First time I ever heard those two words put together. Explain that for us. Well, you, you explained it when you said you are what you eat. And that comment from physicians is a comment that I oftentimes thought about when I was very young and learning to cook and reading cookbooks and thinking about just all the different types of food people eat around the world and how they've eaten through time and how that food has affected them, whether it was health or whether it was religion or politics or economy or gender or any of those other things that become really important when you talk about food. So uh, given that anthropologists um, work with human cultures and study human cultures, and we all know what food is, of course, I, I combine the two. But I look at food not just as an object. I look at it like a process. I'm looking at food from a cultural lens. So it's not just the food itself as it arrives on your plate, but it's everything that precedes it, everything that creates meaning around it, um, all the traditions and customs and areas of meaning, areas of tension. Um, and that's really what we study as food anthropologists. We're very concerned with really just understanding and un unpacking that intersection between food and culture.